On to match three, folks! Team Namek versus the Vals. Now, Team Namek did manage to get their first win last week. Um, and they have been improving, but is it enough to take down the Vals? I, my, my gut feeling says, says no. Um, that's my gut feeling as well. I, my gut feeling enough mm. to actually place money on it. Or, yes, you know, points, same. squee points. I don't want people thinking, you're betting on this? Yes, but only <laughs> squee points. I'm making money off this. You know? <laughs> <laughs> Are you kidding me? I'm the bookie. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it's a good thing, you know what, I have to admit, it's a good thing our betting system doesn't have juice. Mm. Which I never understood, I know I'm not really up on betting, but if you lose the bet, you lose your money and you have to pay juice extra? Shouldn't you make the winners pay that? Yeah, probably. Isn't it like a slap in the face, like not only did you lose your money, but now you have to pay more? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We're gonna make you even poorer. <laughs> Oh, an explosive wave catches Fasha right in the face. Ouch. Oh, I'm almost hoping for another domination from the Valkyries, apart from the fact that it that Namek really don't deserve that to happen to them. I know. I'm not almost hoping for it. I'm really hoping for it. And, and the sad thing is, it's that, I mean, I really like Team Namek, but they got a lot going against them as far as I'm concerned. One, they're in my division. So the worse they do, the better I do. Um, yeah. And two, they're fighting my second favorite team. So, <laughs> I mean, I'm sorry guys, I do like Team Namek. I really hope they do better. And I don't hope they do better. I mean... <laughs> yeah, it's, it's a strange... Thing. I hope they do it's better, really just not as well as I do. do. <laughs> yeah. As long as they're still worse than you, it's not a problem. <laughs> right. And uh, Nail is up by a bar right now. He is, yeah. Um, the Fasha seems to have lost her... Uh, no, oh no, uh, still a... Aggression from last week. Still a nice move by Fasha, stopping him from doing his blast one. Another explosive wave! Catches Fasha again! Ah, oh, explosive waves are so dangerous. It, oh, it is, it is. Yeah, I would have to and say... it's not like you can get behind them and stop it happening. No, I'd have to say the explosive waves probably got the highest success ratio of any of the blast two moves. It probably has, yeah. I mean, I would say I would say a good 70% of the time they're hitting. No, they are. Yeah. And Fasha's behind by a bar now. Still, <laughs> she was before, so. It, and, yes, but it's worth mentioning again. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and Nail, uh, Nail, doing pretty impressive. Nail's not one of the stronger uh, members of the team, but uh, he's definitely earning oh. his keep right now. You say that, but then again, we. Nail always seems to perform, at the very least, as an average player. Right. That is true. I'm it, not trying to sort it's, it's, short it's sell Nail. Like it's not like he's being a hugely unreliable player to put out there first. That is definitely true. He has always been a, a fairly successful starter. And he's showing it now. If he can pull off his ultimate, he can really turn this around. Here he goes! Ulti Mystic Flasher! Oh, we got a high-speed clash! Fasha countering! Mm -hmm. I think that's the best option for Fafra, even if she loses the clutch. Right, he, she still stopped the ultimate. But uh, the, the one downside is that since Nail won the clash now, his uh, max power goes all the way back up. Yeah, that's true. Full power energy wave connects, and Fosh is in trouble. Oh, she really is in trouble. She's sh considering saying that she should use her energy and get out of there. And it's too late now. Down goes Fasha. Oh. Wow. What an impressive performance from Nail. And then comes a Rayleigh. That's amazing. And I, I really didn't expect I was expecting Nelek to get utterly slaughtered. Man. I uh, no, actually I expected a, a fairly even fight because Nail did improve last week. Oh woohoo! Ouch! And 9,000 points of damage. I honestly did, expected Team Val to start going to the lead when a Rayleigh came out. Mm. And a Rayleigh's doing a darn good job catching up. Look at this. Really is very scary. She is. <laughs> She's so scary and tiny and happy. I know. Which adds to it. <laughs> <laughs> and Nail tags out a really smart move from Nail. And in comes late Piccolo. Light grenades, man. If he gets a chance. Is Rayleigh's this the one that uses light grenade? Yep, yep, this is the one that uses light grenade. And Aureli just keeps coming in, not even giving him a chance to breathe. Oh, a special wow. beam cannon. 
Nice move from Piccolo. So is Rayleigh evened it up? No, nail tagged out. So she's nail tagged out, she, right. She, so she hasn't quite evened it up, but she did uh, considerably level the playing field. Mm, she did consider that better than Fasha did. Yes, indeed. And, and Piccolo got behind her for a nice combo. One of the most dangerous places to get in the league is behind the person. Yeah. Makes it really hard for them to counter what you're doing. Oh, I don't... I'm not quite sure what happened there, but somehow Aureli missed and Piccolo got behind and is punishing her now. Look at that. Light grenade. Yay. Oh, no, no, wait. No, oh, not yet. <laughs> Oops. No, don't do that. And uh, Aureli almost went up to max power, didn't quite make it, and uh, Piccolo's in the lead now. Another light grenade connects again, and Aureli's getting devastated here. I think I'm even more scared of Snowy now than I was when we started. I know. <laughs> Aureli's getting pwned. That's not that's not something you see very commonly. <laughs> no, that isn't. The, the Valkyries are usually, even if they don't win, they're a very competitive yes, team. Yes, indeed. Wow, the, the <laughs> chat's full of uh, Namek fans, apparently. Woohoo! No, oh, wow, and another light grenade, and Aureli needs to get out of there. She does. Late Piccolo she has does. just destroyed her. Dear God. Aureli, tag out. Come on. A woohoo. Run away. Wow, Piccolo dodges it and Aureli tags out. Good girl. And then comes oh. 18. Let's see if 18 can turn this around for him. A mm, bit of sadism on the field should be good. Yeah, the, 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 the scary thing about the Vals is that a destructive disc from 18 is that they have so many weapons. I mean, you take out Fasha, fine. In comes Aureli. You manage to hurt Aureli, fine. Here comes 18. You know what I mean? It's like, oh. Yeah, yeah. The only one you're not even even somewhat scared of is, is Videl, and Videl has her moments. So, it's, it's just such does. a scary team to go up against. Mm. I'm, I'm certainly not looking forward to it myself. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm glad it's over, honestly. Hmm. Oh, nice yeah, dodge by Le Piccolo. To be over really quickly and then, or not. And Le Piccolo. Like never come. <laughs> maybe you'll have a bye week. <laughs> yeah, maybe. <laughs> and Le be Piccolo nice. has been very impressive this match. He has been. So is Nail. He's starting to make yeah. a difference. Yeah, Namix. See, this is what I always expected Namix to be. I was so surprised they weren't doing this well at the beginning of the season. It's like they're remembering what they were like at the beginning of Season 1. Right. A high-speed clash. Late Piccolo wins it. What? I, I, I'm feeling sorry for the Vowel, so... Ah, oh, they're not out of it yet. Infinity no, Bullet. They're not out of it, but they're certainly, they're certainly behind. That is true. And uh, 18 starting to finally do some damage to Late Piccolo. Hmm. And if she can take him out, she needs to take him out before he can tag out. The last thing they need right now is a tag out. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> that, that, that would be rather bad news for the Valkyries. Oh, wow! A nice defensive barrier oh, from Android nice 18. And a Destructo Disc that was, misses! Wow, what a waste of energy. Oh. I know she was trying to take him out, but massive waste of energy there. Yeah. Now she doesn't have as much energy to dodge. Oh, Although man. her energy seems to regenerate very quickly. Well, it's part of her setup. They got high tension on her. They got a uh, fighting spirit, I think. Uh, yeah. See. So they, they, they make it so that, you know, she starts charging up really quickly. Mm. Gosh, and, and, and late Piccolo just dangerous. doesn't want to go down. Obviously not. Extremely impressive performance from late Piccolo so far. Yeah, I'm, I'm, really, I'm really impressed and genuinely surprised. I, yeah. Like I said, I didn't expect Namek to do this well. Wow, and late Piccolo has destroyed a Rayleigh almost, and now got 18 down to one health bar left. This is not looking good for the Vals. The only person they have at full health is Videl. No, it's not. Another light grenade? Although Vid Wow. And late Piccolo good is just God. devastating them. Mm, Vid Videl has her moments of being very good, but... And finally, she's, Late she's Piccolo really is... To... Wow. Finally, Late wow, Piccolo is taking out. 18 needs to tag out. 
<laughs> early Piccolo? Yes, early Piccolo. A demon, oh, wow. explosive demon wave, finishes 18 off. Wow. Oh. Didn't even get a chance to tag oh. out. That's, that's scary. Aureli's back in, huh? Yes, if so, if someone's going to turn this around, it's going to be Aureli. But with only one bar of energy, she's got her work cut out for her. Yeah, though it seems that she has Dende's healing, so if she tags out, Woo! you know, as soon as she can again. That's true. 11,000 points of damage from Ping. She's definitely off to a good start. She is off to a good start, you're right. Wow. And do they have the uh, same setup on Aureli? Because it seems that she's charging close to it, yes. Than an 80. She has close to it. Hmm? Uh, yeah. Similar, similar, same build. Yeah, they concentrate on her her energy recharging faster. Wow! And yeah. and Aureli is tearing Piccolo apart. Excited, what? connects, and she gets another health bar of health back. Jesus! <laughs> what a scary little girl. Very scary little girl. And now they're she, even. She could well turn this around. Well, I wouldn't say they're even overall. They still got uh, no. nail, but uh, but uh, I say the vowels are back in this. Yeah, they, they are. It really does depend on how quickly, or if at all, a Rayleigh can take down, take out uh, late uh, the early Piccolo. Early Piccolo, yes, indeed. Oh, and early Piccolo is doing his best to keep that from happening. Ping. Mm. Connects! Oh, for 10,000 points oh. of damage. What a devastating move to Piccolo. Wow. Oh, Rayleigh's really powerful. She is. Well, that, that move's got a trade-off, though. It takes four bars of energy to do. Yeah, that, that's true. But, yeah, so... Uh, very few people have that. Like, all the ones that are like that, the Mad Banquet Rush, those, they all take uh, four bars of energy but do massive damage. A high-speed clash... Yeah. Piccolo wins I'd, it. I'd say they're well worth the trade-off. Indeed. If they connect, of course. Big yeah, of course. I really could still turn this around, though. She could, especially considering she only had one bar of health when she came in. And has almost yeah. completely annihilated early Piccolo. A woohoo! Finishes early Piccolo off. Wow. wow. And this is now an even fight. Pretty much, yeah. Let's see if Nail keeps up his impressive Nail, performance, or if Rayleigh really takes him down too. Look yeah. at this! And also, given how temperamental Slug's been in the past, Videl could well... Indeed. Could well take him out. Indeed, and Rayleigh is to come out. tearing Nail apart right now. Wow. Oh, okay, I'm not even sure what's going on there. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, Nail obviously I didn't get the better that. of that exchange. Oh, oh, and Nail is down. <laughs> oh my oh, gosh! Wow, what the is? Rockers have turned that around. What a scary little girl this is. Very scary. And you know, I, I, I've said this before. You know, I thought the Vals made a huge mistake when they gave up Pan for Rayleigh. I could not be more wrong. <laughs> No, no, I, I, I've been trying to say, to say the same. Wow, and Slug is actually taking down Aurelia. Aurelia's almost dead. She needs to tag out. Maybe do a move and get out of there. Yeah, she does. But uh, Slug's nearly evened it up, whereas before they were a darkness eye beam. Quite a long way. In the misses lead. a woohoo from Aurelia. Misses. She needs to get out of there. Then she tags out. Oh. Wow, Aureli fighting not only well, but smart. Very, very smart. And in comes Videl. And it's Videl versus Slug. Wow. This, this is, this is going to be a very interesting fight. See how this goes. Indeed, indeed. And these are two members that they're both very, they're very off and on. Sometimes Slug has a good match, sometimes mm. Videl has a good match. And it's just, who's the better of the two right now? A high-speed rush mm. connects. Oh. Does Slug get the um, immunity to rush B2s when he transforms? Oh yes he does. All the big characters do. Right. So, so if going Slug giant transforming for Slug right now would be actually a really good idea against Oh Fidel. yes, it would be very bad against Fidel because she has no beam attacks, she's all rush. So it's a matter of can she get him uh, before he goes giant form, or at least get him down enough that a Rayleigh can finish him off. Yeah. 
But right now, so Videl is ahead by a, a bar of health, so... She is, yeah. Whew. But uh, Slug Slug's is looking to catch that up. trying to even that up. Yeah. Poor Videl. It's cute when she tries to use her key blast because they go all of three feet. <laughs> <laughs> Slug misses with the finger beam. Oh, and we got a, a small melee clash going here. It looks like Videl's usually getting the better end of the melee attacks. It does, yeah. This this fight looks like it's looks like it's gonna. I don't, I don't know. know. It looks like it's turning around, maybe, but it's still pretty difficult to predict. I don't know. I don't know. Right? The Vals are in the lead, but not by enough to really say they got a strong lead. No. Slug goes max power. Ooh. What's Slug's ultimate? High speed rush connects. Um, it's oh. I forget what it's called, it, but uh, he like picks him up, slaps him around a little bit, and then hits him with the beam. It's pretty fun to watch. Uh -huh. And uh, <laughs> Videl's up by another uh, another bar. Yeah, I mean, it seems like the Valkyries have got two bar advantage, perhaps. Right, right about Is that. that right? Yeah, uh, 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 um, yeah. if you consider a Rayleigh, yeah. A Desperado rush misses. Oh. And uh, Slug tried one too. Slug some, loses max power. Yeah, some some really impressive countering on both sides right there. Mm, it seems that the Videl's getting the better of it. It does. Slug's still sticking in there, but the thing is, is that okay? Here's here's the thing you got to consider: is how scary Rayleigh's been this match, and, and and it's 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 a matter of can Slug take Videl down and still have enough left in the tank to take out a Rayleigh. I think the answer to that is certainly from my my uh, point of view. My point of view that, that that's a that's a no. Yeah. Especially Sorry, now that Videl is taking a commanding lead in this fight now. No, she has. I I've actually been reasonably impressed with Videl in this match. Yes, she's, she's been, not been. She's not been incredible. But she's cow. certainly not done badly. No, and as this fight continues, she's dominating him. Look, she's ahead, and she wins. Mm. Look at that. Wow! Wow! Videl yeah, really coming out for her team. Fight. I know, and Arayli, holy cow! <laughs> wow, that was a fun, wow. fun match. That was a fun match. And um, yeah. the, the, I have to say, the Namics at least got to take away from this that uh, their team is definitely improving. Definitely improving. They were very definitely. impressive. No, no, they are. They are really improving. On that. All right. And uh, they certainly, certainly did better than the Dragon Ball Heroes did. Yeah. <laughs> Under the next match.